Okay, here we go. We've got some stuff here now that nobody's ever seen before. It's something I've never ever done before. I was wondering how they were gonna come out. Uh, it's knocked my socks off. They, they've come out, these have come out so nice that I couldn't believe it. It's the first time I've ever used brass and bronze for the uh, bolsters on any knives and I'm gonna kinda of go through it um, and point them out to you. We've got a CQC 45, as you know, one of my favorite knives. Uh, deep black checkered handles on it, black micarta, brass bolsters, absolutely stunning knife. Uh, it's got a heft and a feel to it that, uh, I mean, it's, it's strong as a bull moose, I'm telling you right now. This is an absolutely beautiful knife. Mirror finish brass on it. Uh, we'll move on to the uh, Roadhouse, again, uh, what can I say? People ask moms and dads who their favorite kid is. Uh, they're all my favorites, but uh, you know I'm partial to this Roadhouse also. This is a beautiful, beautiful design, beautiful knife. Uh, it's one of my best designs ever. You guys have heard me say that before. Uh, brass bolsters, again, deep black checkered micarta, just stunning uh, checkering on it. Mirror polished uh, brass razor sharp chisel grind on a roadhouse this is definitely a, a dress up knife uh, if you have an expensive Harley this would this would fit you very well CQC7 again never thought it could look so darn nice in a dressed up version without pearl uh, this has a bronze bolster on it again this beautiful black checkered micarta you guys kind of know I like checkering um, absolutely stunning knife. The bronze has a little more gold color uh, because of the, I believe, copper content in the, uh, in the metal. Uh, it's very beautiful. Again, chisel ground uh, CQC7. I uh, can't go wrong with that. First one of its kind. These are all firsts, so you're getting a unique knife. And now on to, again, this, this is the one that really blew my doors off. Uh, I put a bronze set of bolsters on a Damascus bladed CQC6 with pearl handles and I'll tell you what this one uh, will knock the doors off any barn in, in the western United States I'm telling you right now it's absolutely stunning beautiful beautiful knife uh, it could not be prettier whoever gets this knife is going to get it this is one you could put on the wall as a piece of art I'm not kidding I really like it came out stunning I've got uh, Gosh, who's the, who's the Damascus maker that we use, Mary? Devin uh, Thomas. Devin Thomas, uh, high contrast Damascus, uh, beautiful bronze, nice set of pearls on it, uh, chisel ground, very, very cool knife. And we're going to have a few more here in a little while. i got to get back out in the shop and assemble the, uh, the black knives that we're doing. Uh, but right now, this is the ones that, that I've got finished. Uh, we're running to the deadline like I always am. And then I got to get all the knives ready for the lottery, too. But I am 99% done. It's Thursday evening. I got all day tomorrow to finish everything up. Uh, so I hope you're all there. Uh, it's going to be some really, really nice pieces.